Hey cuties, so in today's role playing video, I went to an all girls daycare. Josh, look at me, I have a baby, we can play house. I can be the mommy and you can be the daddy. Ew, I don't wanna play house with a girl, you have cuties. I do not, come on, it'll be fun. I played blocks last time with you. Yeah, cause blocks are more fun, playing house is boring. It won't be boring, come on. Mackenzie, I said no. Please, ow. Josh, you just bit my face. I told you I didn't want to play house, and you kept pushing me, so I responded appropriately. But you bit me. That's what my puppy does when I do things that he doesn't like. Teacher! Teacher! What? What happened over here? Mackenzie, why are you crying? Josh just bit my face. Well, I told her no, and she didn't listen to me. Back up, back up. Josh, you bit her? Yeah, I did. Josh, we don't bite in daycare. But she wasn't listening to me. I don't care what she did. We use our words, not our teeth. Is my face gonna be okay? My face is all that I have. I wanna be a princess one day, and I need to have a pretty face for that. I mean, have you ever seen a Disney princess with a bite mark on their face? No, no, I do not. But Mackenzie, why didn't you stop when Josh said no? Because I wanted to play house. So you can see why I had to defend myself. By biting her face? No, Josh, I'm afraid I don't see. Josh, you go sit in the corner for time out, and Mackenzie, you come with me. We're gonna go call your mom and tell her what happened. What? But that's not fair. Tell that to the bite marks on her face, Josh. Meanwhile. Ow, this is really cold. Hey, would you rather feel cold or would you rather feel teeth? The choice is up to you, kiddo. Wait, what are you doing? I'm calling your mother to tell her what happened. Ooh, Josh is in trouble. Hello. Hi, this is Mackenzie's mom, lady ma'am. Uh, this is the teacher at Mackenzie's daycare. Is everything okay? Why are you calling? Did something happen to my little girl? Everything else okay, and Mackenzie is fine, but we did have a little incident. If you could come down here, please. <gasps> I'm on my way! Uh, hello? Hello? Well, Mackenzie, it looks like your mom is on her way. A few moments later. for time out. Then I got Mackenzie ice and called you just to inform you of what happened. And what about the boy? Is he going to be expelled from daycare? No, we don't really expel. If anything, we give a frowny face sticker. But it was an act of violence. Well, he is a toddler and they're not always the best at expressing themselves in a healthy manner. A healthy manner? He took a chunk out of my daughter's face. What if she wants to be a model and now she has a permanent bite mark on her face? This whole incident could in fact impact the rest of her life. Well, I think you might be overreacting just a touch. I mean, Mackenzie is fine. I don't even think she needs the ice pack. I just gave it to her to make her feel better. I think she's more upset that she didn't get a playhouse. Oh, you don't get to tell me I'm overreacting when there is a chunk of my daughter's flesh hanging off. I do not want Mackenzie around that boy anymore. I want him thrown out of this class. Boys are rough and dangerous and should not be around my little girl. Look, I know you're really upset, but we can't just kick Josh out. He's just a little kid and this is how they learn. There is nothing wrong with boys. They're not rough and dangerous. Well, maybe sometimes a little rough, but they're just kids. And boys can also be sweet and sensitive. Not that little face biter you have in there. If Mackenzie is going to continue coming here, I want her in an all-girls class. I'm sorry, we don't have an all-girls class. It's important for kids their age to be around Around all kinds of kids to learn to adapt and get along with everybody. That's what we want to do here at our daycare, include everyone. Yes, sometimes the boys and girls get in disagreements, but it's best they learn how to work it out. Well then, if that's how you're going to handle it, I guess my daughter will just not be going to your daycare anymore. That's it. I'm taking Mackenzie out. 
later that same evening. So, how's your face feeling, honey? Well, it's just really cold now, but it doesn't hurt anymore. Wouldn't it be cool if Josh lost a tooth and it stayed in my face? No, that would not be cool at all. Well, I hope Josh wants to play house with me tomorrow. I don't know why he didn't want to play today, but I forgive him. Wait, you still want to play house with Josh? Yeah, why wouldn't I? Well, because he bit your face. Well, I forgive him. I mean, maybe he just didn't have a nap today. Mackenzie, there is no excuse. I mean, everyone has bad days, Mommy. I just hope that Josh feels better tomorrow. I forgive him. Well, you can forget about tomorrow because you will not be going back to this daycare. What? What do you mean? But all my friends are there. I don't count friends who bite. The last time I checked, we are not vampires. Well, it would be cool if we were vampires, though. Starting tomorrow, you will be going to a different daycare. That's not fair. I like this place, and I don't want to start somewhere new. I will not have my daughter going to school anymore with dirty, biting boys. Well, do I get a say in this? No, you are just a child. You don't get a say. Now, come on. When I get home, I am going to need some time researching new daycares. Later that night. So, how's your face feeling, Mackenzie? It's fine. I don't even remember which cheeky bit anymore. I'm ready to go back tomorrow. Well, speaking of tomorrow, I thought now would be a good time to announce that I found a brand new daycare for Mackenzie. So, you were serious? You're really moving me? Don't you worry, honey. This is an all-girls daycare, so you are only going to be surrounded with girls. No more stinky boys. I think you're really going to like it. But I don't want to only be with girls. I like being with boys and girls. This is Mackenzie's daycare. Shouldn't she get a say in the decision? Um, in what world does a toddler have a say in what happens? I am the parent, and I say Mackenzie is starting at the all-girls daycare tomorrow. Sorry, kiddo. I tried. I don't want to start at a new daycare. What if they're mean? Mackenzie, it's all girls. What do you have to worry about? Out. The next day. All right, honey. Are you ready? Not really. I don't know anyone in there. Well, that's the point. You are going to go in there and make all new friends who've hopefully only used their teeth to bite food. Now, come on. Let's go check it out. Hi. Hello there. Who are you? I'm Mackenzie. I was bitten, so now I'm here. Um, excuse me? Sorry about that. We spoke on the phone. My daughter Mackenzie is going to be starting here today after an altercation at her old daycare. Yes, I remember you. Well, no worries. This is an all-girls daycare center. No, you don't need to worry about any stinky boys biting you or being rough. They're all about tea parties and glitter and dollies here. Oh, uh, that doesn't sound fun. Kizzy, don't be rude. That sounds very fun. You love tea parties and glitter and dollies. Yeah, but I also like being rough and playing with boys. Well, uh, we don't have any of that around here. Don't worry. Once you get in with the other girls, you'll forget all about those boys. So, do you want to go in now and meet everyone? Uh, I guess so. All right. Bye, honey. You go in and make it a great day. See you later. Meanwhile. Hi, I'm Mackenzie. Do you want to play house with me? We don't play house. Yeah, playing house is lame. We have princess tea parties. Besides, there's no boys here, so who would play the daddy? Yeah, we're not playing house, but you can join our tea party if you want. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, sure. Is that what you're wearing? What's wrong with it? It's like a dress. I love dresses. Well, it doesn't look brand name. You're a kid in a daycare. How do you know what brand name is? My mommy tells me. Well, my mommy lets me pick up my own clothes, and I like pink, so I picked this. Really? Are you on a dance team yet? No. Oh, we mostly only hang out with other girls on dance teams. Well, I'm just a kid. I'm not part of any teams yet. Well, that's sad. At least you're at an all-girls daycare now, so you can get caught up. What was it like going to daycare with boys? Tell us everything. Well, it wasn't bad. I really liked them. E boys. Yeah, we hate boys and they're never allowed to sit with us. Oh, well, I like boys and I like playing with anyone. Well, if you feel that way, then you can't sit with us. Yeah! Okay, uh, bye. Later that same evening. <laughs> Kenzie, honey, what's wrong? I hate my new daycare. What? Why? What's the matter? The girls there are just so mean. I thought going to a daycare with all girls would mean no biting, but it doesn't. Girls are mean, and they judge, and they say bad things hurt your feelings at princess tea parties. Who wants their feelings hurt at a tea party? Oh, honey, I'm sure it just felt like that because it was your first day. Tomorrow, things will be better. I promise. No, I don't like it there. I don't like being with all girls. I like being with everyone. I don't ever want to go back there. Kenzie, you need to go to daycare. I will, but my old one. Please, mommy, I want to go back. I don't know if we can ever go back there after what a fuss I made. Just apologize, just like Josh should have done after he bit me. You really want to go back to that daycare that badly? Yes, please. Ugh, fine. The next day. Okay, honey, you stay here and I'm going to go into
talk to your teacher. Wow, Mackenzie's mom lady ma'am. Uh, I never thought I would see you back here. I never thought I would be back here. So, uh, why are you back? Well, I took Mackenzie to an all-girls daycare, which I thought would be a better fit but she hated it. Turns out she liked playing with Josh, even if it came with some consequences in the form of teeth marks. So what are you saying? I'm saying that my daughter really wants to be back in the daycare here. I know I made a big deal about taking her out, but I was hoping you could let her come back because she's clearly much happier here. I think we can definitely arrange that. Meanwhile. Hey Josh. Hi Mackenzie. But you want to play house with me? I can be the mommy and you can be the daddy. Sure. Okay, let's go. Hey Mackenzie, I'm sorry that I bit you. I should have done that. It's okay. I forgive you. Friends? Always. Arr! Oh, Mackenzie, you just bit my face.